Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Art Jarrett. All right, good morning to you. What I do have, well, we're going to be going into a fog tracker, showing you a little bit of fog here down to our south of Point Sur, as well as fog moving down from the north, getting closer and closer to Point Reyes. We are clear to partly cloudy skies currently, a few high clouds drifting by as well. And what's going to happen later on, you may pick up a little bit of drizzle once this gets closer, but we'll be cool to mild today. The marine layer will deepen, then it'll sink out and mix out again, and we'll find ourselves with uh, a pretty good looking day. Should be the warmest day of the week. We do have future cast, which is going to show us area of low pressure still working around the state moving up and down. It's going to switch positions with the area of high pressure with that will be fairly breezy today along the coast. Winds getting up to 20 miles per hour, possibly gusts up to 25 and then that'll get out of the way. An area of low pressure will set in well to our north as we go into Thursday, Friday, bringing in chances of rainfall for us and the heaviest rainfall we could pick up will be along our coastal mountains. We could see at least up to an inch and a half, maybe in some isolated spots up to two inches of rain. That'll also guide in the first winter storm coming into a uh, portions of the Sierra Nevada mountains and the Sierra, the west slopes there, they could see up to about, I'll call it one to two feet of uh, snow getting into some higher locations. They could probably pick up a little bit more and we'll see lower as we get into Sunday, the, that snow level will drop down and then we'll get into some uh, chances of rainfall getting down to 4,400 feet. All right, what's going to happen today? Offshore winds to start. Then we're going to pick up uh, some clearing. We're going to get some clear skies as well as onshore flow coming right back in the late afternoon hours, putting that cloud cover right back on our beaches and then in the valleys as we go overnight. We will find ourselves with mostly clear to overcast conditions in the overnight hours. In fact, you're going to see temperatures today, 60s, some 70s once you get into Santa Cruz County, 68 over in Wattsville, 70 in Salinas. So Prunedale, you're just about 69 degrees today with 66 in Monterey. We'll get right over into the Santa Clara Valley, getting into mostly 70s today, picking up some low to mid 70s once you get right down into the Carmel Valley, uh, 71 for Hollister, 71 in King City. Santa Cruz might be our warmest spot today though. Tonight, we get into overnight temperatures for 45 to 49 degrees. We have cloudy conditions and cool, moderate breeze coming in off the ocean. So prepare yourself for that. So uh, we'll also see temperatures getting into 60s and 70s for tomorrow. Cloudy conditions with a chance of rainfall coming in later on in the evening hours for Thursday. We're going to see that heavier rainfall start to pick up late Friday afternoon, getting into Saturday, Sunday, and then scattered showers for Monday. And what we are expecting is at least uh, three quarters of an inch to, uh, we'll say that's our highest amount we can get maybe over in Santa Cruz, down to Monterey, maybe a quarter of an inch of rain.